hello everyone so today we are going to look into how to create these multicolored outline effects so here as you can see we have two outline effects one is red and one is blue so we can apply this for all different types of objects including static meshes so skeletal meshes and also you have you can have any color you want I will create all the parameters to define the colors and the thickness as well. So in this video I worked on an outline effect so but uh, here it can have only one color for the outline. So I'm going to use the same material and improve on that to have multicolored outline so if I put some object that is not rendered in the custom depth we still see the outline but not the character mesh color so this is the way it works at the moment so to have different color let me let's it like this so to have a different color this is the outline material that we have already worked on and if I check this mesh under rendering we have Cast render custom depth fast and this is what we have used now and custom depth stencil value in order to use this there is a setting that we need to uh, use so to go to settings like this and search stencil here under post processing we have custom depth stencil pass it's enabled but we have to use enabled with stencil so we can write to this right and read and write this stencil values so we need to enable that then for this character I'll set the stencil value to 2 by the way I do see some flickering that is something we missed in the previous video so to get rid of that make flickering we can use this before tone maybe so now the flickering is gone okay so that's not important uh, that's not the point we want to have a different color for this so for that here we can use this same uh, same texture node here use the custom depth now this is the color that we use for outline I'll name it color 1 and add another color, color parameter Let's get some space here. I'll rename this color to this is red. The next one I'll make it blue. Like this. So then from the from here instead of custom depth I'll use custom stencil and here I'll mask to a component mask and get only R value and let's use from this R value let's use an if node so if A is A compared to B I'll use B as 1 and 
then if a is larger than b i'll use red and a is smaller than b i'll use blue and use this one as the b value which goes as the outline value now if i apply this you see here because the custom depth stencil value is zero we have a blue outline here i have used two which is larger than one but only some places only on some places i get the blue on some places i get red that's because we do this we have these offsets to calculate the outline so we need to have the same offsets if we need to have the same color for each part of the outline so let me duplicate this okay because we have three separate sections that we use for outline first one we don't have any offset second one we have a uv offset like this third one like this now we need to add these together right okay now if i apply it should be working see now this guy has a red outline this guy has a blue outline here also if i make this larger than one two or something this box will also have a red outline so yeah that's how we have multiple colored outlines so i'm gonna stop this episode right here and thanks for watching as always project files will be available for the download in the patreon page link would be in the description below and if you like to support my work you can get the membership of the patreon club see you in another episode goodbye